Hey, uh, ladies and gentlemen, uh, I have some good news and I have some bad news. Uh, the good news, America has too much cheese. The bad news, we have way too much cheese. Experts say an overabundance of cheese here in the U.S. has created the country's largest stockpile of the stuff in more than 30 years. American dairy farmers are facing an actual oversupply of the product, adding up to billions of pounds of cheese. That's right, billions of pounds of cheese. Or just slightly less than Romano's macaroni grill puts on a single entree. In fact, we have so much cheese that in order to get rid of it, every person in the country would need to eat an extra three pounds of cheese this year. Well, I think I speak for all Americans when I say, challenge accepted. <laughs> Come on, three pounds? Three? Is that all you, is that all you got? I'm yelling at the cheese gods. We can eat three pounds of cheese in our sleep, more if we're on Ambien. Forget Rio, this is our Olympics. America, we have been training for this for years. We consume so much cheese, we smuggle extra servings stuffed inside our crusts. <laughs> we use it to spackle over the holes in our pretzels. My God, we're the country that looked at nacho cheese Doritos and said, we can make those nacho cheesier. <laughs> there comes a time when every generation is asked to serve their country. So I'm calling on all Americans to fight the Gouda fight. We don't do this because it is easy cheese, but because it is Havarti. We must walk softly and carry a big mozzarella stick. We must boldly Asiago where no Manchego has gone before. And, and if we do, and if we do, we will become cheddar than all the rest. So dig deep and find that extra Gruyere. Get in the calzone and join me because I'm fed up to here. <laughs> and if you think I can do this provolone, you ricotta be kidding me. <laughs> we must come together and slay the monster. Just fun, do it. Yellsburg, ready for Swiss?